episode of Diva Diorama, we'll be opening some capsules from the Make It Mini Diner Series 2. So let's get started. I ordered six capsules online at lolsurprise.com and they arrived 10 days later in this package. I haven't opened it up yet as I wanted you all to see what I got, how many duplicates I may or may not get from this single order, hopefully from the same product lot. I'm crossing my fingers that I don't get duplicates and I'm hoping that having ordered them direct from the factory, so to speak, would somehow influence that. I'm not really sure. I just thought we'd try an experiment. Also, ordering them online at lolsurprise.com, I was able to sign up for an account and immediately got, was it 10,000 points? that I could use towards my first purchase. Plus I ordered enough to get free shipping, so save extra that way too. So here's the six capsules that I received, but before we start opening them up, I wanted to try something that I haven't seen anyone do yet. So here I've got my kitchen scale. It's nothing fancy, just an inexpensive kitchen scale that I wanted to use to weigh each capsule. I'm going to make sure before I start that I tear out the scale or make sure it's set at zero first before I start weighing so that I get as accurate a reading as possible. I'm really curious to see if these capsules are different weights. Because if they are different weights, we might be able to use the weight of a capsule to identify what's inside or at least use the different weight of each capsule as a way to differentiate between capsules in a set of capsules. So here I am. I am marking the first capsule as number one and I'm marking the weight and I'm doing that directly on the capsule with a Sharpie. And I'm going to repeat the process with the subsequent capsules here. This is number two and it weighs 109 grams. So we're just gonna fast forward here um, through this process. Oops, sorry guys, I guess I don't know how to count. I'm just going to double check to see that this capsule is 109 grams, and it is. And uh, we've also got number two that weighs 109 grams. So it already appears like we might have duplicates. So I'm gonna put these in order and uh, so we can start opening them up. Okay, so this is number one and it's 111 grams. Oh my, I have no nails. Even sped up, this is gonna take a while. So I'm just gonna stop right here to go grab a tool. That's a lot better, but still a little tricky to get these open. Yay! First layer down. One more to go if I can just find the chink in the armor. There it is! Yay! Free at last! And just in case we've already forgotten, this is capsule number one and it's 111 grams. So let's see what's inside. We've got... Have a sunny day. Second one says thank you. Thank you, Miniverse, for bringing us Series 2. We've got a collector's guide, instructions, a shine on placemat, and a tabletop. And the table base, which I'm going to assemble there. And we've got Package number three, keep cool. Package number four, happy sun farms. And package number five, another have a sunny day. And package number six is the utensil packet. So we got one, two, three, four, five packages plus the utensil package. These packages are definitely different from the series one capsules. They seem to be made of a coated paper as opposed to a plastic. So that seems a nice change. 
towards a greener product. So in our first Have a Sunny Day package, we have whipped cream. Woohoo! We saw these containers in series one. They look just like the real whipped topping containers that you see in the frozen section. It's got cherries on top. Second package, we've got, oh, we've got the bananas. Too cute, the whole banana in a package. Moving on to the second Have a Sunny Day package, we've got, oh, Neapolitan ice cream. This is so super cute and it opens. Oh my goodness. And we've got a strawberry and a chocolate and two vanilla scoops. So it looks like we're making a banana split, guys. A Neapolitan banana split in a banana ball. And in the next package, we've got chocolate syrup. And in the utensil packet, we have, look at that, it's an ice cream scoop. So cute. So we can scoop our ice cream. And of course, we've got the tweezers and the finial or the knob for the uh, dome, which comes, of course, in every capsule. So there you have it, guys. Capsule number one, which weighed in at 111 grams, is the banana split. We'll take a closer look at these adorable pieces in a future video. So stay tuned. In the meantime, let's move on to capsule number two, which is 109 grams. And again, this is one of two capsules that are 109 grams. So it'll be interesting to see what's inside because I think we're definitely going to get a duplicate here. I'm trying another tool here, but I don't know if it works as good as the first tool I used. Yay! So let's pop this one open and see what we get. Okay, let's sort through all these packets and set up the table. Oh, and we've got a doily. Yay, we've got something different, a doily. So it's going to be some kind of cake or pastry, I'm assuming. And first package, we've got strawberries. Happy Sun Farm strawberries. We've seen th these before in the first series of Make It Mini Foods. But uh, those look a little translucent. I think the ones I got were more opaque. And here we've got berry syrup. Oh, okay. So it looks like we're getting some kind of ice cream dessert again, maybe, possibly, or sun-baked sweets. These are so cute. I think they're called cigar wafer cookies. I know the French call them pirouettes. We saw chocolate versions of these in some Make It Mini Series 1 capsules, but these have pink stripes instead of chocolate brown, so I'm going to call them strawberry pirouettes. Moving on to the next surprise packet. Have a sunny day, thank you. <laughs> and, oh, it's Sunny's Bites. How cute is that? It's some kind of waffle, waffle bowl. So it's, it's, maybe it's a waffle. Waffle bowl sundae or something. Cute. We're going to place that over there for now and move on to the, the last surprise packet, except for the, uh, the utensil packet we've got coming up after that. And it's strawberry, strawberry ice cream. Cute. Again, this opens up and we've got four scoops of ice cream there. Fun stuff. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Strawberry. It's a strawberry waffle sundae. And I wonder if we're going to get another ice cream scoop. Is that going to be the utensil that we're going to get with this? Or is it going to be something else? Okay, we've got the tweezers. And oh, there we go. It's the spoon. So that was the strawberry sundae, folks. 
Moving on to capsule number three at 125 grams. And I'm get, actually getting better at opening these up, but I'm just going to speed through it here to spare you from watching me struggle. So in this package, we've got the base for the table. We've got the tabletop. So I'm going to assemble that and make a little room here. And let's start opening packages. Let's open the Keep Cool packet first because it feels pretty substantial here. So we've got, we've got, oh, and I <laughs> forgot to mention we've got another doily. I think that's a bigger doily. We've got vanilla something, vanilla cream, I guess. Okay, so moving on to the this packet. The thank you packet. Let's see what's inside. Oh, it's a a cake stand, a blue cake stand. I've I've seen that some of them can get warped, but this one looks looks okay. So I think we're good. I'm gonna put the the doily there. So I think we're gonna get some kind of cake here, and it's a sponge cake. It's got some cracks in it, like a real cake, I guess. And it's a little rubbery, and slightly flexible. I just love this container. It looks so authentic. Put that on top of the cake stand. Moving on to the next packet, have a nice, or oh, have a sunny day, excuse me. <laughs> and inside we've got crumble. I've seen this crumble before in series one, Make It Mini Foods. Good stuff. I, these little packages are just so adorable, so realistic. So let's sit that there and uh, let's open the next packet here. Strawberries. Oh, we've got some whole strawberries that the uh, Miniverse chefs were kind enough to haul for us. And accompanying that, looks like a Look at the details on those strawberries. And we've got a dollop of whipped cream. Oops. <laughs> Almost had a little make a mini explosion there. Okay. And finally, what utensil are we going to get? Are we going to get a cake server maybe or something to, I don't know, spread the vanilla cream? Let's see. We've got the tweezers. Oh, and we've got a spatula. I think an offset spatula would have been extra, but a regular spatula will do. So that was the strawberry shortcake. Okay, moving on to the next capsule, number four, at 105 grams. And we're just going to speed through this opening here so that we can get to what's inside. Let's sort through the contents here and set up the table, count the packages, and see what we've got. We've got a doily, another doily. So let's open up the Keep Cool here first. The Keep Cool packets always have kind of the most interesting items. And we've got, oh, it's like a little jar of cream, pie cream of some sort. Next packet, have a sunny day. Doing a little housekeeping there. And we've got whipped cream. We've seen this whipped cream in series one. Oh, I don't know if I've ever seen. Those look smaller than the ones that I've seen in the Make It Mini series one foods. 100% good stuff. Whipped cream. So cute. So let's arrange that there. Opening the next packet. Ah, let's see what we've got. And it's a baked sweet, sun-baked sweet. What do you call these? Like clamshell containers, I guess, with little cookies. Oh, they're like how like little black and white cream-filled cookies. I won't say the name brand that it reminds me of. We all know it. <laughs> Set those there. I think we're we're doing um, the chocolate cream filled cookie pie. So here's the pie crust. Cute. It's the chocolate cookie pie crust. And again, these 
containers, these clamshell containers are just, it just takes it to another level of realism, which is so much fun with these mini verse, uh, make it mini foods. And we've got a pie tin. It's like a blue enameled pie tin. Okay. And uh, for the utensil, we've got, oh, hey, it's, I haven't seen this before. It's a, the pie server, cake server. I don't know if the camera can pick that up, but it's got a little, like a, just a micro serrated edge there for, for extra realism. So that was the cookies and cream pie. Okay, moving on to capsule number five. This is the other one that was 109 grams. So I am guessing that it's going to be a duplicate. But uh, let's get it open here and find out. Because, you know, in the name of science. <laughs> Miniverse science. This capsule was a bit challenging to get open. But of course, after removing the layers of a Miniverse capsule, you're rewarded with a very satisfying pop when you squeeze open the capsule. Okay, so we're gonna sort through what we've got inside this capsule, set up the table, do a little housekeeping, and see what we've got. And we've got another doily. So I'm gonna be obnoxious and call it. I think this is another packet of pirouettes. Yeah, I think this that's what it is. Let's see. Maha! <laughs> so we did get duplicates. So we'll just skip opening all these other packets again. Yeah, in this packet, I can fill the cylindrical strawberry ice cream container. So we got another strawberry sundae, which is great because you can do a lot of other creative things with the pieces in that set. Moving on to, this is capsule number six, and it weighs 115 grams. Since I keep turning this around, let's just take a moment to admire the graphics on this layer. It's so well done. So this one's a little heavy. <laughs> Which might be a good thing. Because maybe it means we're going to get food this time instead of a dessert. No such luck, I guess. Hoping for food, not for dessert. Oh, well, let's set up the table and see what we've got with this doily. So again, we've got five packets and this one is already coming open to reveal... Another cake stand in pink. So cute. I do have to say that the cake stands are, are pretty adorable in this series. The, the cake stands in the first series were really cute too. Okay, let's open this made fresh next. And we've got oh, the bundt cake. Oh, so cute. Lemon bundt cake. Look at the detail on that. It looks like a real bundt cake. And it's a little squishy too. So cute. I just love the packaging. It looks so realistic. Okay, let's see what's in the Keep Cool packet. Usually something perishable. We've got the glaze. Let's uh, arrange things around here so we can see things a little clearer. That's a lemon glaze with a little nozzle for the bottle, which is so cute. How many times have we said cute? in this video. Okay, next package is the lemons. A clamshell of lemons that hopefully won't explode when I open it. These sweet little lemon slices were also used in the first series of Make It Mini Food Capsules. And let's see what's in this packet. Oh, sprinkles. I get, I must, I'm gonna call them lemon, lemon sprinkles, lemon candy. So cute. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to apologize about my dishpan hands. <laughs> I do a lot of dishes. Many dishes. Okay, we're putting those back because we don't want to lose them. Let's uh, get that back on there. And let's see the utensil. We get a fork. 
I'm actually pretty excited about the fork because I didn't get too many in the first series. So that was the lemon bunt cake. That's it, guys. Thank you for watching this pilot episode of Diva Diorama. I hope we've taken a little of the mystery out of collecting these surprise capsules and that the information I shared in this video helps you with your Make It Mini collection. If you use this strategy, hey, let me know in the comments. I'm definitely going to use it again myself very soon, so like this video if you want to see similar content in the future. And subscribe to and share my channel with your collector friends. Because remember, growing old is inevitable, but growing up is optional. So do something fun today! Until next time, bye!